You're welcome to today's training session. Today we'll be learning how to measure correctly with our hydrometer. How to take our hydrometer reading correctly. This is an hydrometer. It is used to measure the chemical concentration of a chemical solution. Mostly, when we are producing bath soap using the cold method, we normally take the hydrometer reading because we don't want our soap to be too concentrated that it will start itching and peeling the arms. So we need to make sure that our caustic soda solution or our light solution is in a safe range before we use. That is why we always take the reading. So I'm going to be teaching you how to take the hydrometer reading for your soap before production. First, these are, you see numbers here. You see numbers here. The safe range for, our for our caustic soda solution, which is a light solution, is 12175. One, two, and for bad soap, I normally want to take 1250. But 1275 is also safe. You see it within this range. Or if it is below, if it is below, it means your caustic soda solution is very, very con is very, very concentrated. And when it is below, you are going to add more water to bring it up. If when when your solution is below the this this below this one two seven five, it means your solution is very very conk, it's very very concentrated, it's too harsh. So you add more water to bring it up. And when it is above, maybe it is here, maybe one two two five, it shows that your solution is very watery. There's more water inside of it, so you add more chemical to bring it back to one two seven. So you are, you adjust the reading with either water or chemical depending on where your reading is. If it is below, you add water to bring it up. If it is above, you add more chemical to bring it up. So now we are going to be measuring our caustic soda solution. How did I get here? First, let me put it for you. Get one part of your caustic soda crystal and three parts of water. What did I say? If I'm using one kg of caustic soda, I am going to dissolve it in three liters of water. One part of caustic soda to three liters of to three parts of water. Whatever you're using as your measure of 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 a unit of measurement. If I'm using this cup now, if I use one full of this cup for my caustic soda um, crystal, meaning I'm going to use three of this cup as water. And make sure when you are adding, when you're dissolving your caustic soda, don't always add, don't always pour water into it. Always ensure you have put your water first, then you pour your caustic soda into it to avoid spillage. It can spill. And when it spills and spikes on it, it can cause an injury. Not just caustic soda, any other acid, like your HCl, like your um, sulfuric acid, when you are dissolving it in water, always ensure you pour it into the water. Don't pour water into it because it can spill and it will cause an injury. So let's go right into how to measure using how to read a, a hydrometer so this is my caustic soda solution i fermented it already i dissolved it using one part of water one part of mpm so that caustic soda crystal and on and three parts of water so when you want to measure ensure you get a smaller thing that your caustic soda that your hydrometer can float in because it needs to float for you to for us to take a read so you just drop it in it will float so you can see i'm about producing soap with this light solution you can see it's at that point at, at, at the green and near close to the top of the green is at one to seven so this is fine it is fine so if it was above i would have added more chemical if it was below like here if it was below like here then i would have added more water to bring it down but look at it now it is fine so i can go ahead and start producing my um soap so this is how to take the hydrometer reading of your solutions this is i'm using because even if it is your soda solution this is the same thing depending on the reading you want to take if it is one two seven five days at the green line if it is one two fifty there it will be after the green line so you can see so this is fine so we just go ahead and start producing thank you